My name is Rita Fontaine and I am Ella Fontaine and we are super excited to bring to you a new line of products. We have designed our own rhinestone templates, templates. and stencils. stencils, making rhinestoning so much, so much easier. easier, so, so much so, so much easier and amazing and you're going to be so grateful and excited and whatever lots of adjectives so you can buy them from www.crystalqueen.com.au or or on our brand new etsy store fontaine fontaine so check out the links below to follow us on all of our social media channels and don't forget to hit subscribe why? So that you can get our tips and tricks, be up to date with our latest designs and tutorials. See all of our newly released products in, uh, you'll get to see us doing it live. And uh, yeah, we yeah. can't wait to share more about our yes. new products with you. Exciting new journey. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, everybody, this is the Belle Epoque Beautiful Era. era. Stencil. The age of beauty. Oh, is it? I was really excited by this because the first time I tested these templates, I envisioned lots of pinks and champagnes okay, and I came up with something really pretty. And then I thought, okay, I want to do something really fun, really out there. And I've ended up using Hyacinth, Peacock AB stones, Light Siam, and Citrine with Light Siam larger stones and ended up working in this really circus direction. Yeah, it is very ringmaster, isn't it? Mm. And so this shape is actually this shape that you cut up yep. and yep. Uh, and just used. Yeah, I just here. used that section, reversed it to get the other way. And of course, these little sections, the little, almost like a bow shape, uh, will be great as garter toppers. Um, I really like how the curve cuts the bust and the straight I've used as a choker. Also be really cute as a glove topper as well, or uh, an here. armband, or a wristband. But before I actually put this together, a really great trick is to get your stencil and photocopy it with dark fabric behind it. Like, like this, yes. So once you've printed out a few copies, you cut them up, really play around with all the different possibilities for it. Once you've, you've pinned it on, you've got a design in mind, then you can go back to your spec sheet and work out how many rhinestones you need, how many of the sew on stones you need, uh, saves a little bit of time and money in the end. And then you you've can, got a really good plan. They can either rhinestone straight on, or what you've done here is, Ella has actually rhinestoned onto a mesh but you had a little bit of a problem. You found that one layer wasn't quite enough, mm. quite enough purchase. And that, like this, yeah, there's not enough purchase for the, the rhinestone to attach to the glue. So I did lose a couple. Um, it, whenever using net, I absolutely recommend doubling it or putting it onto um, another, on top of another piece of fabric. Um, and so you've made these and was this your original plan? Or have no, you I just them? played around with it and it went in this circle, circus kind of ringmaster direction, which I just love. Um, so putting them on, making them into appliques first means that, you know, you're not necessarily committed to the original idea. Mm, you, you can, can really play around. around. And... Now, we're not couturists here. If you want to just glue them on, that's okay. We won't tell anybody. Um, you can also hand sew them on. Um, if you're working on a flat garment, you can use a sewing machine to sew on uh, the appliques using a zipper footer because that'll help you get a little bit closer, closer to the edge and then just scallop off the um, appliques. I don't recommend putting fancy stones on until you've, ha you've sewn, uh, machine sewn it onto the garment. That is the Bella Puck. We can't wait to see what you do with this stencil. The, it is, the creativity is limitless and uh, please share your designs with us. Yes, please. Thank you for watching. And if you have any questions, please let us know. Please comment below or get into contact with us directly. When you buy the stencils and templates, we really want to see what you do with them. We want you to share it with us on social media because we absolutely love seeing what other people do with the rhinestones that we sell. Have fun. Ha, ha, ha.